Okay, so in this example, we want to plot each point. Okay, and so the first point we have is A. We want to plot negative 4 and then 3. Now, the first part of the ordered pair is the direction on the x-axis. So you go left if it's negative, you go right if it's positive. And then the second ordered pair is the y value on the y-axis. If it's positive, you go up. If it's negative, you go down. So for the first ordered pair is negative 4, 3. The value of x is negative 4, so we're going to move over negative 4, but we're not going to plot the point yet because we need to now go up 3. So we're going to go up 3. And now let's check our answer. Okay, now we want to be able to plot negative 1 and 3 over 2. Now keep in mind that 3 over 2 is the same thing as 1.5. So that means we're going to move to the direction left once. So we're going to go to negative 1. Then we're going to go up 1.5. So that's in between 1 and 2. So therefore, let's check our answer. And there we have it. Okay, next, now we want to graph 5, 4. So that means we're going to move now to the right five times. And then we're going to go up 4. And therefore, there is our point 5, 4. Now we're going to graph 2, 0. So that means we're going to go to the right two times. And we're not going to go up or down because it's 0. So we're going to leave that point right there. And therefore, that represents 2, 0. Now we're going to graph 0, 5. So that means the first point, 0, doesn't go either left or right. It stays right where it is. And the 5 now tells us to go up 5. And so therefore, that is our next point. And the last point is going negative 2 and then negative 1. So we're going to move to the left, negative 2. And then we're going to go down, negative 1. And there is our 